everybody. It is me, the Inave. Hope you all are doing good. So listen up, it's been a while, but this is the Nave fam coming to you right here. We're in Las Vegas. We just finished up a wonderful time during Christmas, and I hope you all had an amazing time for Christmas too. So we just wanted to come together, make a quick video, just to kind of like wrap up the little details that I didn't get a chance to put down in some of the other videos. So we, we had quite an adventure all December, and to be honest, it was not a normal month. Um, a lot of changes are coming for us in the future. A lot of things that are just gonna bring on tons of stress, but at the same time, hopefully good changes for us. So in the meantime, we're just trying to like cope with everything, wrap it all up, but we couldn't do that without making sure that we closed off December right. So we wanted to make sure we just kind of put together a video. So I just kind of grabbed the footage that I had throughout the month and I just wanted to edit something nice so you guys can kind of see some of the fun things we had a chance to do. You know, we, uh, we had family come in and visit us, which was great, you know. Three different spots. We, we definitely had a chance to go in, have fun, and grab some footage while we were there. First spot that I made sure to grab some footage was inside of Tivoli Village, and there's a place there called El Dorado Cantina. Um, it's totally decorated with the aesthetic of old Mexico, Dia de los Muertos, and the food was on point. Superb, really good. I mean, it came with some heat. So if you go to Mexican food places and you're tired of food tasting like nothing, and then you have to throw stuff all in it to taste something, and you think it's good, this place came with heat, it came with fire, we were filled, it was delicious. El Dorado Cantina, throw up a little link right there. That's in Taboli Village. And just walking around the park there, they have like a Christmas village experience and then of course a nice brewery. Kids like going go there because there's like a play area. So let me show you a little bit of Taboli Village. So there's more stuff, but you gotta pay. Um, also, along the time frame, we had a chance to also go to Glittering Lights. Now, for anyone who's never heard or seen Glittering Lights in Las Vegas, Glittering Lights is basically the NASCAR speedway that's on the edge of Las Vegas. So come during Christmas time, they create a huge uh, display of lights that surrounds the entire raceway. We don't actually go in the raceway, but it's surrounding the whole thing. And to be honest, it was pretty big. It took about 25, 30 minutes or so to actually drive through the whole thing. And that was a really fun experience and pretty cost effective too, because they just charge you for the cost of the car 
to just drive in, you know, so I wasn't having to pay per ticket for every single person that's through there. So, I mean, if you have a really big Suburban or something like that, load that sucker up and, and go watch Glittering Lights in Las Vegas next Christmas while you're here. After Thanksgiving. Oh, Six months. We opened in November, the end of November. So, so I brought Alani okay. to the Glittering Lights. Alani, say hi. Hi. And Avery. Oh, and look, Avery. Outside, look outside the window, there's a window. Well, I already showed them that, but we're gonna see the Glittering Lights at the NASCAR Speedway in Las Vegas. Yay! And I took, I don't know how long it took them, but there's what's the wait, so I'm gonna say it's six months. We have Grandma it, Angie with us, and Tia Lisa's driving. It's gonna take a while. It's Annabelle's gonna take a while. Front stop, and we are in for a little bit of a line here. <laughs> yeah, we have to wait. We have to wait, but we'll get some And a Wimmo is right there. Wimmo, Wimmo, Wimmo. Check it out. So it's our first time ever seeing Sam's Town. So what is up everybody? Once again, it's the Nave fam coming to you and we're here at Sam's Town in Las Vegas. Now it's another part of the city you probably have never seen, but there's a big kind of like animatronics Christmas kind of celebration thing they do here. So we decided let's bring the kids out and let's see how this looks. So stay right there with me. Let's take a look around Sam's Town and Let's see if it's something you guys might want to check out, all right? So remember, hit that like, hit that subscribe. The Nave FM, stay with us. The escalators over there? So we are right in front of the Century Theater. So here they have a pretty big uh, box office and movie theater system through it. Up top, I believe, is their bowling alley. There's my kiddo. Now, as I was saying, we're probably gonna get some food here. I believe there's a TGIF, and there could be some other things that we can do. Maybe watch a movie, I don't know if we'll watch a movie, but TGIF, I think there's like McDonald's and stuff here. There's an arcade just in front of us. Um, the big animatronic section, I'm not sure where it's at, so we're gonna all venture together and go find it.
Okay, so it looks like we found the Christmas display. So let's take a look at Sam's Town's Christmas animatronics. So overall, the place is not huge. This is a very small casino. Alani just wanted to see some of the lights. What'd you think, was it? Ah! So, not too big of a place, but there's supposedly a show that goes off once an hour every hour from about 4 p.m. until 10 o'clock. So, it's 5.30 now. We'll have to see if we do stick around for 30 more minutes, but we at least wanted to come see Samstown because most people don't even know that it exists because it's on the boulder strip of las vegas but we're going to see if we can find anything else to take a look at this was sam's guns actually those belong to mr boyd Uh, we try to have the best amount of time of fun that we can while we're here in Las Vegas in this tiny apartment. But, you know, 
we celebrated together. Even New Year's Eve, we rung that in together. So this was our way of closing off the year of 2022. We started in San Diego. We ended it right here in Las Vegas till the midnight struck. And, you know, it's been a blessing. It's been a wild, crazy year. And like I said, we have more to come, a lot of changes. Um, we've got some other videos that we're gonna work with to tell you guys what's going on with us as a family and what other things we'll be filming. But for that, just stay tuned. Take a look at this footage. I hope you guys love it. The Nave fam, make sure you hit that like, hit that subscribe, and stay right there. Helpers today? Yes, yeah, I'm the taster, so I see if they're good. Who's helping you over there? A, um, my body. She's also an elf working. She's already done the first, so she's watching us. Alright, so we have some sugar cookies right here. And normal cookies. They're chocolate normal. chip <laughs> cookies. Chip. The classic. We are in video mode. It's Christmas dinner. Christmas Eve. Oh, it's Christmas Eve dinner because that's how Daddy celebrates it. Christmas Eve. Annabelle's got her red wine going. She got her filet mignon with that Bernays sauce. We got a nice little cheese spread. Avery's got some. What do you got, son? Sunny D. Sunny D. <laughs> He's got some very fancy Sunny D. Alani, what are you drinking? Coke. Coke. All right. Well, we're wishing everyone a very merry Christmas Eve. And Tomorrow's Christmas, so let's enjoy our dinner, guys. And yeah, here we go. Cheers. All right, Annabelle, you ready to do this? First drink of the night. What are we drinking here? We got some sake bombs. A sake, sake bombs. So let's do it. Cheers to New Year's Eve. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Happy New Year's, guys. <laughs> Ready? Stay right here. So, we just did the nine o'clock East Coast New Year's with us and the kids. We wanted to do it before they fell asleep, but knowing our luck, they'll probably just stay awake the entire time. Uh, we are trying to see if Las Vegas will still have their uh, fireworks show. That's what I'm looking for. Because there's a crazy storm that's coming in, we were able to get out there. There was no rain, there was nothing right now. Avery is eating his, <laughs> his, chips. his chips away. So with that, we wanted to make sure we recorded at least, you know, the first, you know, New Year's countdown with you guys. We have had a blast this year. We've been in Las Vegas for so you're filming what we could, bringing you our family. And tonight we wanted to make sure we closed off 2022 and brought in 2023. What do you want to say to the people, Annabelle? Happy New Year. And I'm saying that right back. Happy New Year. We got a lot coming in 2023. So peace, love, the Nave fam.